Invisible Invaders, 1959, directed by Edward L. Kahn, starring John Agar, Gene Bryan, and Philip Tung. The recently deceased are brought back to life as part of a plot to take over the world. Can a couple of determined scientists figure out how to stop the undead menace before it's too late? There's no denying that George Romero's 1968 classic Night of the Living Dead was a hallmark for the zombie genre. It became the gold standard, inspired decades of films, and even spawned a couple of sequels. Pre-Romero zombie films are always fascinating to me, especially when they think outside of the box like this one. The Living Dead are reanimated via alien possession in this film, and they look great when they're on screen. It's definitely a film that makes you ask, if they're so advanced, why attack the Earth in this way? But I give it a pass because of how pulpy and creative the premise was in an era where the average zombie film involved voodoo. Zombie fans seeking gore will be disappointed, I'm afraid, as they show no interest in eating the flesh of the living. You do get to see a zombie use a gun, though, which is cool. The ensemble cast really carry the film and keep the film engaging and tense, with John Carradine really chewing the scenery up as the voice of the invaders. A lot of stock footage is used to show the destructive power of the living dead, an unfortunate byproduct of a low budget. The true form of the aliens was portrayed by reusing the suit created for 1958's It, The Terror from Beyond Space, which Khan also directed a year before this but obscured using soft focus and lighting to make it look different enough in the film. Paul Dunlap's score for the film is quintessential 50s B-movie fare, enhancing the cheesy fun with suspenseful orchestral parts and menacing theremins. Verdict recommended. In spite of the noticeable limitations of a low budget, this film still manages to be incredibly fun and entertaining throughout. That concludes this week's review. If there's any obscure sci-fi or horror film you'd like to suggest, feel free to leave a comment below. Make sure to tune in next time for another thrilling low-budget adventure.